But first, I would like to welcome Jeff Applebaum and Linda McKeever. We're going to be talking about the fabulous comedy Uncorked coming up at Retzloff Vineyards. Jeff is one of the fabulous comedians. And Linda McKeever, you know her from Open Heart Kitchen. They are the beneficiaries, I think that's the word, of the, the comedy Uncorked. Welcome to both of you. Let's have a little fun. Let's do that. Great yes. to see you. All right, so Jeff. Yes, Robin. <laughs> Comedian, is that is that really is that like really what you do for a living? I'm, I'm actually here to talk about timeshares. Oh, sorry. time yeah. darn it, and that is funny. Mm-hmm. Well, okay, so really? Yes, it is actually by by training. I'm an engineer, and uh, engineering into comedy is a natural step. <laughs> <if you wanna laughs> say, okay. You know, design a computer, tell a joke. It goes yeah, together it goes like, together. like, I can like this. That. Yeah. And and that's what I do, and I, I play characters in shows. I play in the Rat Pack. I play Joey Bishop. In, the, yes. in that show, and I do stand-up comedy, something I always wanted to do. As a kid, I grew up in New York, where you have to be funny if you want to live. <laughs> so comedy was a way to survive. Right. So people would try to mug you. If you can make them laugh, you have enough time to run. Right, exactly. Which is and I was fast, even with 25 pounds of math books on my back. Don't kid yourself. <laughs> and, uh, and then, when you get into junior high school, Oh. I discovered that if you can make the girls laugh, they would like you no matter what you look like. And, you know, and, and so, oh. and that, yes, and I had a mustache and this and that. Cause I look in at my middle school? It, it happens. Okay, you know, yeah, all right. All right. Yeah, it, had, it comes through the genes, I don't know. And, and, um, and after that, then as you get to be an adult, it's just a matter of you know, public validation. You make people laugh, they laugh. They love me, they love me. Or, or and one day, true? some night I'll have a show like that, I think. <laughs> one, one day they really It'll will be, laugh. Maybe July 29th. Let us know. That way, well, July 29th, vineyards. yeah, let's, let's be. <laughs> well, I'll tell you something, there is something about that. People comment about me and say, you know, certain, uh, you know, you're this, you're that, the other. I'm waiting for them to say you're funny. That to me oh, is the ultimate compliment. Yeah. And when people laugh and you're at a party and they're laughing, there is just this is something contagious I'll, about I'm waiting that, for the it? same thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it will happen. It will happen. So there's something fun coming up. It's the Comedy Uncorked at Retzloff Vineyards. There's going to be three um, of these. Yes. We'll talk mostly about yours, Jeff, because that is happening on Thank July so 29th. Much. But Linda, as the Open Heart Kitchen uh, director here, you guys are the recipients of this. How does something like this work out? First of all, remind our, our viewers about Open Heart Kitchen, but then how do you get, you know, sort of in on great things like this? Well, first of all, the wine girls have um, brought this to our attention and they've done a wonderful job and and they really help us with the food drives and with donations and everybody gets to come out and forget about their troubles for just a moment and have a really good time and we're grateful to be a recipient of this. Yeah. So, so open something kitchen. like this benefit where everybody gets to come out, mm -hmm. have a good time, great food, great wine, mm -hmm. great comedy. I believe in you, Jeff. I think Thanks. you're going to make them <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm going to do it. <laughs> and there's more besides you in case it's not in Oh, there's some great comedians enough. on yes. the show, which right. I'm looking for. Right. But the idea of people <clears throat> bring in a some food is that yes. the idea yes you can, you can bring us um, your canned we need canned items we need specific uh, items they're on our website you can go for our list of the mm. type of items that we need you can also bring in gift cards for places like Costco where we can buy produce and that mm. type of thing oh, that's a great idea as well yeah. as buy the raffle tickets right. at the uh, at the club itself at the winery itself if they bring canned foods they get raffle tickets and we're giving away Absolutely. fabulous prizes right Absolutely. What, a couch or something? Or what <laughs> Look, we have a couch. Rich Corinthian leather. You know, Possibly even the bull that goes with the couch. The I bull don't that know. goes with the something, couch. Something, but there, it's, it's, it's fabulous. It's, it's wonderful anyway, fabulous. and because everybody wins with something like That's this. Right. I love all of this. I like you said, it's, it's sponsored. I like it. It's sponsored by the wine girls. You need to snap. It's like the wine girls. <laughs> yeah. They got just, that going on. You just can't on. say wine girls. You I, have to go, you know, well, wine girls. Okay, well, okay, fill me in. Who yeah. are the wine girls? Do I know? That's a band from the 70s, don't you remember? No, that? well, not much to Josie you. and the Pussycats, oh, the wine girls. No, were who are the wine girls? Because maybe we should have them on my show. Oh, absolutely. One of your wine girls is sitting in your audience right now. Yes, and all she right. Could, and she could tell you, but this entire idea, came, they came up with it one evening about how to make people laugh and how to actually help um, a local organization. All right, all right. Now this, now, I don't know if either of you know this, maybe we'll have to get a shout out from our audience, but um, this is the second year that this third is? Year. Third year. Third year, okay. And we've got some pictures actually showing of, of the events in the past. Yes. Um, is this your first time with, with uh, Comedy This is Unparked? my first time doing comedy. At all? <laughs> oh, so good. I appreciate Impression. you guys giving me an opportunity. <laughs> 
I want to thank my mother. My no, the uh, and all of a sudden I have a southern accent. Why? Why you ask? I have no idea. But it, it's it, that's the first time he's out of New York. Yeah, so playing out right. often. How are you doing? And yeah, my son now, he's funny. He's uh, he's 15. He's 15 years. Take he's learning to drive. You know, yeah, I remember my dad teaching me to drive. Stay in lane, you moron. I'm like, Dad, okay, thank, thank you. <laughs> and now it's like, I'm, I'm worried about him taking the written part. I can't help him because, you know, the New York yeah. State Driver's Manual and the California one, if a pedestrian walks into the street, what do you do? Hey, accelerate and hit him. I can't help you, so that's the right answer. No, in what California, the pedestrian <laughs> is king. Yeah, it's in California. And you, like in San Francisco, heaven help you if you go through that yellow oh, and get man. stuck because then the pedestrian's going through the crosswalk. They're just surrounding your car. You're, you're kind of in the center. And you open the doors and you yeah. look at that. Yeah. They're like, they're like dude, dude, you're, you're hostile. Yeah. You know, in New York, it's like, hey, hey, I'm sorry, I didn't see you there. You either, okay? Yeah, yeah exactly, and, and, uh, exactly. People, oh, go to Italy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Any place. The pedestrian. The streets are just wide. Yeah, yeah, the pedestrian. All right. But, know, so it, let me just get down to the business yes. here. It, Jeff, you are the funny guy on July 29th, joined by funny people such as Lynn oh, Ruth man. Miller. She's great. Is she? Oh, she's okay. fantastic. I think she's 103, actually. No, she's Is she really? She's 79. Okay, so <laughs> she's going to make us laugh. And Charmin Summers. Charmin Summers, wonderful lady. I love wonderful her um, Her profile picture. She's just lying back on a pillow. Yeah. I love that. You know, why pretend we're all poised for the camera? Let's just relax. relax okay, I love that. And, and then, of course, our lovely Faith Alpha, part of the reason why we're all here today, she put this show together and then couldn't make it, and we just got to give her a shout I'm, out. Yeah. Hello, Faith. Hello, we love Faith. you. We love today you. Today, I'm, I'm representing you. Yeah. I'm yeah. New York, New Jersey. We're close enough, and I cut my. I had hair. I had hair just like yours until this interview. Yeah. They said, "Be yourself." Yeah, be yourself. She is very funny. She got to do the Oprah Winfrey um, yes. show thing, where yes, she, she got to go into her past and find uh, one of her teachers, and um, mm, it was just it was just it's wonderful. wonderful stuff. Faith is funny, and she's also incredibly moving, compelling, poignant person. Yes, I love is. that about her too. So anyway, and she will also be back on August 26th at Retzlaff Vineyards, uh, along with Mike Moto, Conrad Roth, and Carla Clay. 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 Paula Clay. Very okay. funny lady. Okay. I'm All just, those oh, of course. Two wise. And then on September 24th, Lynn Ruth Miller will be back. Tessie Chua. Chua and Michael Slack. Michael. So here we are, literally bringing to the Tri Valley, Livermore specifically, just the best and funniest shows ever, and then helping Open Heart Kitchen. It, it's, and it's a great opportunity. I mean, most comics know in the comedy community, you know, you hear New York, Chicago, Vegas, Livermore. It's, it's part of the circuit. <laughs> So I kind of feel like this is almost an arrival. I don't know, yeah. where do I go after this? Yeah, I, yeah. and when you did Vegas, did go. you ever think you'd be in Livermore? Oh, I know. I'm thinking one day, I remember getting on stage in Vegas and going, God, it's not Livermore. Livermore, but... one day. One day, and, t and today, uh, it happens. Thank you, because I have faith in Faith Alford. Yeah. And well, and getting to be on this show, too. Yeah. I mean, there's Robin there's, Farr, yeah. I mean, same yeah. thing. There's it's the like, Good Morning America, and then there's Robin Farr. It's exactly. And right. I Actually, really, it's the other way. Yeah, exactly. It's, Who's it's first? the other way around. Yeah. Well, I actually have had a few guests on that Larry King had on. Um, I would watch his version of it and then come up with better questions and do my own version of it, cheating a little bit. And I actually had a couple of Oprah guests on the show, too. Wow. So you guys are in real good company. I feel Yeah, that's, yeah. That's fabulous. That's right. Yeah. All right How about so Dr. Phil? Is he on the show? No. No, no, he's got his own show. <laughs> now, let me ask you this, though, and I think, Jeff, you can probably answer this the best. Um, pressure, uh, obviously, pressure. wine's involved, so we're talking about probably more of an adult crowd. But it could, could people want to come out and sit on the grass and enjoy with young people? people or would the comedy just not be maybe appropriate for under a certain age? I think the encouragement in general if you're bringing your kids to a winery, you're sending a message. Yes. The, uh, so I think it'll be a nice, nice uh, bring friends, bring family uh, that are that are going to appreciate. It's it's not it's not a uh, you know adult show only, but it, it's going to be something for mature audiences. I think. Yes. But but the environment's great. It's going to be a nice warm summer night in right. Livermore. Yep. And you can bring your own food. Bring your own food. Or you can get you it catered you, by yeah. Foz. By Foz. Yes. Foz mm -hmm. Which is delicious stuff. Yeah. And, and you, you sit there, enjoy, have some wine, relax, enjoy the show. You could bring you could bring anything but your own uh, booze, I believe. Well, uh, I'm sorry. Which makes sense. Fine Do not bring wine. Beverages. Yeah. yeah, it's too Don't bring wine to the winery. No, have some no. class. Bad for a change. <laughs> yeah. Please, Livermore. Help me, Livermore. <laughs> <laughs> okay.
You want Pleasanton to beat you every time? Oh dear. Oh no. Don't Literally. get me started on Tracy. <laughs> oh wait, that's the wine girls now. I'm sorry. <laughs> but it's, it's, oh, I mean, people love it. Uh, thank you. And then, uh, you and said then you're going to have it. these these wonderful comedians. So just one after the other, just no. get up they're there and wonderful. just I'll make be, you laugh. By the time I'm up there, they're like, well, bring the other guy back. Yeah. But, the, uh, but no, it's fun. And, and in this economy too, like you said, people love to laugh. People want to laugh, and, and not a matter of forgetting, but humor is what helps us ease the pain. And yeah. you think about it, like last year, what Chrysler, our, one of our nation's greatest car companies, starts to go under. Who buys them? Who comes in to buy them? Fiat, the Italians. Mm. All I know, I bought a new LeBaron. It came with a baseball bat and a much bigger trunk. So I don't know what that means. <laughs> Now, now give us time? all your. Do I need to give you don't, some time no, don't give us okay. all of your good stuff here. That so wasn't my good this, stuff. This okay. <laughs> this is what's going on. You can I see Jeff, uh, Jeff Applebaum and a whole bunch of other funny people at uh, Comedy Uncorked. And, and at funny Rutz, people. And and some funny people. <laughs> and funny people. At Comedy Uncorked <laughs> at Rex Lock Vineyards. <laughs> this is benefiting Open Heart Kitchen, so you're going to want to bring some food with you, not just to eat at the picnic, but to really One, give eight, to eight, others. Eight, eight, four, one, two, five, zero, five, five. You are funny. Oh, thank you. Yeah, great. You're going to be just great. She yeah, said she I'm a funny. funny. You're Why funny. And Linda, as thank always, you. wonderful to see you. Love what you're doing at Open Heart Kitchen. So and if it is support. just combining this, it just makes it perfect. It's win-win. I know that's a used term, but it is for everybody. Great. So thank you. Great, great to have you here. You'll come back. I'm looking forward. All right. Thank you. We got plenty more conversations coming up. Don't go away. I will be right back.